I think you could make the case that the physical system, so aerobic capacity, strength, is even more malleable than our cognitive systems. And we know that our cognitive systems are quite malleable. There was a study that did um, a six-week aerobic exercise training program to assess changes in VO2 max, oxygen consumption, of course, uh, workload and endurance. Now, in the older group, these people averaged 80 years of age. In the younger group, the people averaged 24 years of age. In both groups, there was about a 13% improvement in VO2 max, a 34% improvement in maximal workload. So that's basically how many watts could you hit? And then a 2.4 fold improvement in endurance capacity. I found this staggering, and I would not have predicted this um, prior to seeing this study. Now, of course, I want people to understand that the absolute levels of all of these things were significantly higher in the 24-year-olds. That's a given, right? They have a higher, you know, they, they put out more watts, they have a higher VO2 max, et cetera. What we're talking about here is the malleability of the system. What we're talking about here is how much could individuals improve in six weeks and the answer is they both Im improved dramatically. And I should point out something else. This particular study followed the six week training uh, uh, cycle that I just described with an eight week deconditioning period. Um, and what's worth pointing out here is that the older group declined much faster than the younger group. So both groups were able to see significant gains, but the older you were, the quicker you lost those gains with inactivity.